Yeah, you're going to get graded too. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Peyton. Uh, 12 to nothing win tonight. You went five innings, got the win. Talk about uh, the run support you got from, from the guys in the dugout tonight. <laughs> yeah, I can't do it with you there. <laughs> uh, it, it was it was pretty incredible. I think it was just really good for us to watch our bats wake up like they did. Uh, you know, it's been off and on the past few weeks with the hitting, and I think kind of jumping out like we did early on and setting the tone, of course, like that sets the tone for the weekend. And uh, one thing that we've talked about a lot is, you know, hitting is contagious. So it just takes one, and glad we got a – Got a lot there early to help me out. So. Luke Boyers hits that line drive home run in the second inning. Was that where you guys could just kind of knew that it was going to kind of tumble from there with that? It felt pretty good. You know, you, you see somebody, Luke has been swinging it great this year. and uh, But like I said, hitting, hitting is contagious. Everybody sees that and everybody kind of gets that confidence of, okay, like, let's roll with it. Uh, so. It, it just opens up everybody else, everybody else and everybody gets, um, you know, pretty fired up about it and just keeps rolling. Uh, you, know, you gave the ball over to Maziello in the sixth inning there. Just mm -hmm. talk about his performance in relief tonight. Oh, it was disgusting. Uh, he's he's been he's been doing great. I mean, it's we were talking in the bullpen just now. Like he's been doing a great job building week after week, um, especially like he had a great outing last week in Texas too. Um, so, uh, I mean, he's been doing great. That was huge to have uh, him go as long as he did because it'll open up a lot of things tomorrow. So we have almost a full staff uh, ready for what could be a doubleheader tomorrow. I noticed on Tuesday that you guys got their hair cut. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. They come into tonight, it looks like about 75% of y'all got buzz cuts. Can you, yeah, can yeah. Your thoughts on that? Um, I really wasn't planning on it. Uh, we just, some guys showed up at our house and they were getting the haircuts. I was like, I might as well join it, you know, and get the get the boys rolling again, uh, see if it'll wake wake something up. And um, so far it has, so my bus cuts are 2-0 right now. So. You know, I know it's your first year on the team here, but you're one of the older guys on the roster. And So how have you, uh, you know, assumed maybe a little bit of a leadership role and what has your message been to the guys? Um, I think I was just tried to, just keep doing the work and um, you know just be there for the young guys because I mean the freshmen on this team are amazing and it's um, I mean one coach Delora and recruiting has been amazing and uh, so like have, having them come in and I'll try to answer any questions that they have um, but just try to be a you know a, a voice for everybody and I mean, yeah, it's it's been it's been pretty incredible to watch this freshman work as hard as they have. What's the mentality of the team going to the rest of the weekend after you have such a strong start like you did tonight? Don't stop. Don't stop. Don't wait. It. It's not going to come to us. You know, it's we got to go out there tomorrow and do the same thing over and over again. We scored 12 runs last night. Uh, none have been scored tomorrow. So um, just got to keep rolling. Keep have that confidence that we had today because we kind of played it with a swagger that we had at the beginning of the year today. And it's good to have that back and you gotta keep playing with it. Only through 96 tonight, you know, you think you can go tomorrow? Um, I mean, I think, I think we'll leave it till next week again. <laughs>